This issue of time is important, especially um, in an online world. In fact, we've become increasingly impatient. The quickest way to lose customers is to cause them any kind of delay now. In, in fact, uh, I, just before we go there, the UK is leading online, uh, online purchases worldwide. It's fascinating. In fact, the US is nowhere on this. If you look at the growth of US online purchasing, which is something like 16-17% um, last year, uh, we're, we're seeing 20% year-on-year growth. Uh, you could consider why it is that the US is falling so far behind. In the US, uh, in the UK, it's already 6% of retail sales also. also um, we, our average online purchaser is spending £1,200 a year, around 20 to 25 purchases. In the US, much, much less. Fascinating. In almost every European, in every European country apart from Denmark, less than the UK. Interesting. So we do it online. We do the window shopping, but we actually complete online. This is unusual. We're unusually trusting, actually. We engage profoundly in online, on, in, in the online channel. So it's difficult for us to go to another nation to see where the trend is. We are the trendsetters, actually, globally. Interesting. So, uh, the, but the quickest way to lose money is to uh, cause a delay. 40 seconds delay would probably lose you 80 to 90 percent of your customers, I guess. 20 percent, 20, 20 seconds is enough to lose 40 percent of your business. Now think about that. We're saying 20 seconds. In 20 seconds, you can lose 40 percent of your business. And we are only in the first hour of the first day of the online digital revolution. 40% of the business in 20 seconds. Now we can debate about whether it's 30% or 60%. It's a lot. So what that means is you, you need to bring that insight. We find it very frustrating, don't you? You find it frustrating if a page doesn't, doesn't seem to load. You think, oh, it's crashed, or the site's down, or get a live. You've gone to a competitor's site. And you do that in about eight seconds. So 20 seconds is an unimaginably, scandalously long way to wait for anything. So 20 seconds to answer the phone. 20 seconds in the checkout is a long time. Because you could be doing so many things online in the same time. So in the increasingly impatient world, the issue of logistics starts to become much more focused. Whether the product is actually available or whether they have to get it from the back of the store. And whether the product will be delivered on time tomorrow morning or whether it's actually the day after or the day after that. Seconds absolutely count. And we are, as I say, are just at the beginning of this incredible impatience. Now, at the same time, it's interesting that a big retail trend is to waste time. Now put your hands up if you really enjoy self-service checkout. Put your hands up if you don't, because you think it actually wastes your time, you find it frustrating. Interesting. So we have a lot of emotion in this room about online self-service check about self-service checkout. And there's a split between those that like it and those that really don't. It's an important trend and it is transforming retail because it's so cheap.